Today is a day for distillation. We're gonna take a look at an experiment and have you try to predict what the results will be. Now you remember, distillation is all about the volatility of the elements that are being distilled. We're gonna be using water and food coloring. And so we're going to end up with a green solution. And the question is, is the water more volatile than the food coloring, or is the food coloring more volatile than the water? And what we distill out is gonna give us that answer. So here's our liquid, a mixture of water and food coloring. We're going to boil this and it's going to, the gases are gonna come up through this and then it's going to condense through this condenser. Now you'll notice that I have it hooked up with water coming from the sink and water going back to the sink. So all of this is full of cold water and then we're going to end up distilling that into this particular flask. So remember, you have to create a hypothesis as to which one of these will be distilled or which will distill the majority of it. Will it be the food coloring or the water? And we'll take a look and see. All right, here's the process once more. We're going to heat this mixture of food coloring and water. The vapors are going to come up here. They are going to condense, running through this condenser and come out here. Now the question is, is it going to be clear? Is it going to be green? Or is it going to be somewhere in between? All right, we're beginning to see this boil a little bit. You notice that it's condensing here because the top of the flask is cool. And so now you're gonna go up into the stopper and you'll see that some of that is condensing because it's still cool and there's nothing yet flowing up here. So we have to give it a little while longer until everything's nice and hot, and then it will condense in the condenser. We've got a good rolling boil now, so it won't be long. All right, there's quite a bit of stuff going on now. We've got this bubbling here. We actually have it condensing a little bit here. We move down to the condenser, and here's what's happening. We're condensing inside. There's a tube inside that water jacket where it's condensing, and we have liquid flowing down and let's take a look at what the liquid is. The liquid looks like it is perfectly clear. So how'd you do? Remember the volatility of the liquid is going to create a higher vapor pressure inside the liquid. The higher vapor pressure is going to come out first and the other will follow. So in this particular case it looks like water has a much higher vapor pressure than food coloring. Distillation, pretty cool.